Two ancient human skeletons found earlier this year in Jiayi City were fully excavated this week and transported to Tainan's Museum of Archaeology. The remains belong to a man and a woman who lived in Jiayi about 2,500 years ago. They were buried facing each other and their hands behind their backs. Archaeologists believe that the two of them were family members. Earlier this year, two ancient human skeletons were discovered at a railway construction site in Jiayi City. They are estimated to be about 2,500 years old. They are the first archaeological finding of its kind in the city. Considering the way in which these two skeletons were interred, I think they must have had some kind of kinship. They may have even been family from the same household. Now we have some basis for carrying out further research on human activity in the surrounding area. The remains were found on the construction site of a railway elevation project, which is currently 30 percent complete. The two skeletons belong to a man and a woman. The way they were buried, with their arms behind their backs, suggests that they were related. The remains have been sent to the Museum of Archaeology in Tainan for preservation. The archaeological work won't affect our construction plans. We have a fixed timeline. Trains will start running on the elevated railway by late 2025. The project will continue as scheduled. Archaeological findings have been few and far between in Jiayi, making the skeletons particularly significant for the city. The tomb, which dates back to the late Neolithic period, could shed light on a prehistoric culture known for its grey-black pottery. In terms of age, this site goes back to Taiwan's prehistoric culture, to the late Neolithic. That's more or less the spring and autumn period in China. Of course, at the same time, they were at different development stages. In China, they may have already begun making bronze artifacts, but the humans in Taiwan may have been at a different stage of development. The two skeletons have been sent to the Museum of Archaeology in Tainan, a branch of the National Museum of Prehistory, where they'll be studied further. Afterward, the remains will be returned to Jiayi City for safekeeping.